Alien Invaders Plus for the Odyssey 2. Developed and published by Magnavox, it was released for the Odyssey 2 in 1980. You take control of a laser cannon and has to destroy all the enemies above so you can rack up the points. You control the laser cannon by moving it from side to side with the joystick and the action button is used to shoot. So this is unsurprisingly a clone of Space Invaders, but it adds a little more to it to keep it interesting. For one thing, you have a little man controlling the laser cannon, and if the cannon gets destroyed, you can convert your shields into a new cannon and get back on the attack. The enemy waves are as follows. You have the shields, cannons, and robots. You can shoot any enemies above the shields, as the shields themselves are impervious to earth cannons. You can also shoot the bullets, but you'll want to shoot the main baddie, the Merciless Monstroth. He isn't worth anything, he'll just be the biggest nuisance out of everybody, and whoever wins 10 rounds of battle, wins the war. You can win a round by destroying all enemies on screen, or lose one if your unprotected man gets hit by enemy fire. Overall, this is a fine clone, not sure what the plus means, but I've had my fun for the day, now I'm gonna hand it over to you. Be brave, Earth is counting on you. And stop. A fiendish new dimension comes to one of the most popular arcade games of all time. A clone is a new dimension? I'd hate to see a pirated cart. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to like, share, and comment on the video. And if you want to see more quick views, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. This is Brian the Blue, and I'll see you next time.